Hey guys, welcome to my NYC vlog. I'm here with my girl Joss. We've actually been here in New York for not 24 hours yet, but we, we got here yesterday. This is our first full day out, and um, I don't know what we're about to do, but it's, oh my gosh, it's, Hi. this is Joss. Hey guys, we're in the Big Apple. Yeah, we're in the Big Apple. I was actually supposed to get here yesterday at 9 a.m., but the flight was oversold, so then they were like, oh, if you have flexible plans, then um, if you want to fly out tomorrow, then um, can you do that? <laughs> so then I was like, okay, like I'll take the 7 a.m. flight. You could take this, she could take the 6 a.m. flight. We had different, we were flying different um, airlines. We checked into our hotel. We went to go eat, and then we got dressed and went out for like an hour. We went out, and then Jessica had to come back and change her shoes, and I was like, but I was trying to be nice. Today, we are going to, what the hell are we gonna do? We're going to the World Trade Center Memorial. That's what I wanna do. Okay, so we're gonna go to the World Trade Center Memorial. I've never been there, I don't think. Um, but honestly, right now, I really wanna go to like a karaoke bar. And I don't know where they do karaoke this early. I'm sure I could find it. Why do you wanna go right now? That's so random. I think because we were listening to music and it just made me want to like sing and dance and vibe. So this is my face of the day. Oh, this, I've never worn my hair like this before. My inspiration was this random girl last night at a bar. We went to a bar last night and it was super fun. Manhattan proper. It was so fun and the people there were so nice yeah. and welcoming. Like it was so bomb. Like, and they loved us. This guy was like obsessed with Jessica and kept following us, which is kind of scary. Um... But yeah, this random girl there had her hair like this, and I was like, oh my gosh, that's cute. I mean, I've seen this before, obviously, but then I was like, I'm gonna wear my hair like that tomorrow. Lip color is NYX Berry Strudel. But um, yeah, I'm so excited! Aren't you excited? Sunglasses that I brought with me today are the key sunglasses that I was talking crap about, but they grew on me, I like them. Um, and then I'll show you guys my OOTD when we get downstairs. Where were you when 9-11 happened? I was at home, I was getting ready for school. I was in the eighth grade. So it was Brittany, but we didn't know each other yet. <laughs> my family are like very much into like the news and stuff, and not until they were like watching the news and they're like, oh my God, the Twin Towers just got hit. I, I don't know about you, I didn't know what that was. I didn't know what the Twin Towers, I didn't even know where, um, I didn't yeah. know what the World Trade Center was. I was like, Me is neither. that a bank or what? <laughs> And then, wasn't there like an attack in Washington, D.C.? I didn't know yeah. where that was either. Yeah, we were too young. <laughs> but what I do remember is um, like the, the media and all that stuff. And I remember there was like images of a man like jumping off of one of the buildings, which like still breaks my heart to this day. And then they were like showing transcripts of text messages, like the last things that people were saying to their family on the plane before it hit the building, like, that's nuts. Yeah, I was at home, I was getting ready for school in the morning, and then my mom was like looking at the news, like, like crying kind of, and I was like, what's wrong? Like, what's your, what's your mood, what's your vibe right now? I really didn't understand it, to be honest, because I was too young, but then when I got to school, like, it was like all serious, and people were like coming to pick up their kids, and then like my mom came to pick me up and then we went to go like my brothers were in high school at this point so we went to go pick them up and um it was freaking scary like that whole day because remember they thought there was going to be like an, an attack on la because we didn't know what what was like we didn't know what the hell was going on so yeah we thought there was going to be an attack on la and it was just like such I had like butterflies in my stomach that whole day. And not good butterflies, here. but I was like, kind of like, am I gonna die today? <laughs> Jessica and I literally have no idea where we're going, but <laughs> we're gonna try to figure it out. So our plan right now, I don't even know what neighborhood we're in, to be honest, you know? I think we're in Tribeca. No, we're not. Oh, <laughs> not yet. So our plan is to just get on the subway and then get off wherever appeals to us. But I could go for like a drink right now and some music maybe. <sighs> happy hour. Do people do happy hour on Saturdays? Me and my girl just found this random pub. Um, what is it, O'Reilly's? O'Reilly's pub. Very classy in a plastic cup. Um, 
This is like my favorite wine at the moment. It's Matua. I think that's how you say it. So yummy. It's so delicious. It's from New Zealand. I wish there was a game on. I know. Oh, want to watch football tomorrow? Yeah. So tomorrow we're going to go um, to a sports bar. I'll find out, like, I'll, I'll look for, like, a, a cute little sports bar. Yeah. And then we'll, and then we'll um, dress all American. And then we will watch a football game, football Sunday. Um, don't know what we're doing tonight. Um, Yesterday we literally left the hotel at 2 or 2.30. It was done. So I had a blast. Like a f***ing blast. Yeah, pretty much. And now we are headed back to the hotel. I totally forgot to do an OOTD, but this is my OOTD. Um, you see my hair, you see my, you see my hair and face vibes. Shirt, H&M, this sweater, I don't know, but it's just a regular cardigan. Pants are from Abercrombie and Fitch. They make my favorite jeans, personally. Are, you, are we hopping on the subway? Yeah. Jeans are Abercrombie and Fitch, and um, my shoes I got at DSW. They're by Crown Vintage, and I love them. I love Crown Vintage. I think they're like just exclusive to DSW. I feel like it's one of their brands, so it's kind of cool. How do you feel about it, Joel? Just a glaze, Janet. Can I have one other glaze? Another glaze? You got me? Thanks, girl. You're a rock star. Wash your legs, girls. Keep it classy. So we're out here on Wall Street. I ordered a hot sausage and I'm eating it now. And I ordered a fish gyro. I'm waiting for it to be done. Black girl problem. Black girl life. Me and Jessica are back in the hoat. In the hotel, that is. We went to this little jewelry store because Jessica forgot her jewelry at home. Like she forgot to pack it. So she felt some type of way about that, right? She has a mouthful of fish right now, so she can't talk. Mm -hmm. <laughs> She's eating a fish gyro. Mm -hmm. Is it bomb? Other than the fact that you think that it's chicken. I scoop what it is. <laughs> and then we went to Dunkin' Donuts. Let me get those um, donuts out of your backpack, girl. They're probably, I just was sitting on them. Um, I think they're smushed. <laughs> That's fine. I will still eat it. Um, because everybody talks about Dunkin' Donuts. You know what? When Dunkin' Donuts came to LA, everybody was like, oh my gosh, Dunkin' Donuts. They're building a Dunkin' Donuts in LA. And I'm like, hey guys, what's the big deal, you know? And so now I'm gonna, um, try it for myself and see if it's the business. Look at this smash bag. Camera. Huh? Try it on camera. I am. I'm gonna do, um, a review. Um, I'm obsessed with Dwayne Reed because, like, I guess it's like Walgreens pretty much, but I feel like they had, like, groceries in there. They had somebody making sushi. I'm like, we don't have this in LA. Like, it was just so much in one place, right? They have, like, high-end cosmetics there. It was kind of cool. But Lord knows I don't need any um, <laughs> makeup, any more makeup. I bought these foot things. Well, they're foldable flip flop. I mean, um, flats. I have some at home, but I forgot them. But seriously... I played myself by bringing heels to New York. Never again. Tried it. <laughs> like I tried it. So did Jessica. So yeah, we're just we're about to just relax really quick, and um, then we're gonna. Are we gonna take a nap? I don't want to take a nap. We're, yeah, we're not gonna take a nap. Um, I'm not gonna show you Jessica right now because she just woke up from a nap, and um, she's looking a little rough. Um, <laughs> so am I. I slept so on my makeup. <laughs> Can you open this? We are gonna 
make some coffee, and then drink it. Oh, we got wine, but totally forgot to get a bottle, of, bottle opener, and somebody's coming up right now to bring us a bottle opener, so that was nice. <laughs> <laughs> I'm trying to act like a vlogger. Can you tell? Like, I'm specifically trying to yeah. act and talk like a YouTube vlogger. I feel like a lot of vloggers just talk just to talk. So Jessica and I are dressed and ready to step out. So you can check for my outfit really quick. Today I want to be more cash, more comfy. So this is my face, face of the day. Purple smoky eye. I loved the lip that I wore earlier so much that I was like, mm, let me wear that tonight. Dress is from ASOS. He's the course. Okay, yeah, we need to go outside. And these heels were like $20, so. I'll show you guys outside, but these are, this is a choker that I bought in the big ass hoops. And my hair's half up, half down. My girl Joss, I did her makeup. Check for her. Hi. Um, Jessica and I wore um, jackets out and it's like, why? <laughs> why? Take a right on part. Take a right on part. Ew, I don't want to walk. Thank you, you too. Enjoy your apple. <laughs> He's eating an apple. Uh, check for me. Hi, what's the address? It's a love story, baby, just say yes. Okay, anyway. Let me turn Taylor down. Sorry, Taylor. Um, hey, it is a beautiful Sunday morning with my girl. Hey. Joss. What's up? Um, we're about to step out. We want to go see the Brooklyn Bridge. We woke up this morning. We're still we're still jet lag, like point blank period. We ate some sandwiches in bed <laughs> and some salt and vinegar chips. Um, it's kind of embarrassing to admit. Um, and we woke up this morning around 10:30 or so, almost 11. It was pretty damn late. And woke up, went to go get some breakfast, ate it in bed. That's like our new vibe. It was it was actually bomb, huh? Mm -hmm. We were listening to Ella Fitzgerald radio and sipping some coffee, getting some nutrition in our bodies, and we got dressed. Um, I put on a different, I'm gonna show you guys my OOTD. I had on a turtleneck and jeans earlier, but I am so freaking like, I can't fit any of my pants right now. Like um, Regina George from Mean Girls. Remember when all she could fit is sweats? That is my mood. So today, let me let me just show you guys a quick OOTD. Let's do head to toe. I'm just rocking a ponytail. Um, Nick Sable matte lipstick. Um, a choker, and then the cross necklace that I always wear. This um, long, what is this called? Button up shirt is from Forever 21. I love it because it's long enough to cover your butt if you're wearing leggings or something. And I got this. Ooh, hey, I got this jumpsuit from Fashion Nova. This Fashion Nova sent it to me. So shout out to Fashion Nova. I'm rocking it, girl. And I'm rocking my DSW Crown Vintage booties. Um, today, girl, my feet are toe. My feet are toe up. Do you want to do one here or do you want to do one out? Let's do one outside. Or do you want to do it here? Okay, Jessica wants to show you her OOTD. Okay. Hey guys. So, Come to the actually, light. I need to... This lighting is bomb. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Lit. <laughs> hey guys. Okay, so <laughs> I'm at the top. This is actually my first time doing this. At the top, I'm rocking this Neff beanie that I borrowed from my girl, Brock. Um, just because my leave out is um, not cooperating. Um, <laughs> the shirt I got from H&M, which 90% of my clothes are from H&M. Um, <laughs> these jeans are Express. I don't know if you can freaking see. And I'm just wearing like some red tinnies, which, um. Wait, let me hold the camera. Show your jeans, girl. Rock it. Some jeans, some cute tall girl, tall, tall girl vibes they're, if you're a tall girl They're tall girl this. friendly. Yeah. For the most part. <laughs> and I'm just rocking some red. Rock, red rocking some tinnies. I know, I need to bring, you know what, I'm gonna bring and my, my backpack. Pack. My backpack is from H&M. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. We have no sense of direction in New York City. Like the streets, I think like in LA, the streets are just like this and that, okay? So it's easy, like, oh, this is on Hawthorne and Rosecrans. <laughs> But in New York, it's like streets go this way, that way, this way, curve, like, and it's like, what is the vibe here? All right. 
We're about to hop on the two. This is my favorite train. I don't know why I love it so much, but I do. I just feel like you could go everywhere on the two. Well, Jessica and I made it to Brooklyn Bridge. I don't want to keep walking because I'm freaked out. <laughs> Um, I don't like heights, but there it is. Mm -hmm. See the vibe, see that guy. See those ladies. See traffic down there. to Chimay, so we'll see. Me and Jessica don't want to go home, we're sad. Got some yummy meatball sliders, meatball ricotta sliders. My girl Joss got some spinach and artich artichoke dip. She's a vegetarian. I wanted to get a vegetarian friendly um, dish, but nothing else was appealing. First, we just got done at 121 Fulton Street which is a sports bar that we love. And um, now we are on our way back to the hotel. Hi, Joss. We're on our way back to the hotel. <laughs> yeah, that was your type. Uh, we're on our way back to the hotel and we are gonna get dressed for the night because tonight, what time is it? How'd you know that? I looked at the map. Oh my gosh, this is our, this is our little neighborhood. I really I love know. this area. I is like we are staying in the financial district and I love it so much more than like the tourist places because there's less people it's less annoying there's less like stupid places like H&M and like I mean I love H&M but it's just like if I'm out of state traveling like I don't want to go there it's just walking my dog taking a sh that dog just took a shizzle my nizzle um anyway so yeah we had we have a goal tonight to be dressed by 10 o'clock. What time is it? 6.50. 6.50, that means we have three hours if we can. <laughs> but we still have to like pack and set up vibes for the morning. I'm not gonna pack. I am. I can pack in like 10 minutes. I can already see myself at waking up at myself. five o'clock pissed off. <laughs> yeah. Or not five o'clock, like 10 o'clock. Um, no taxi, you're gonna let me walk. Okay, so um, yeah, if we cannot get dressed in three hours, that would be freaking sad. Went to watch the LA Rams game, have to represent for Los Angeles while we're here. Oh, hey guy, <laughs> hey, <laughs> I'll be on camera. Um, but no, we are, and I think the Rams won, but it was like the fourth quarter, there was like seven minutes left. So, and I was like, okay, let's get the heck out of here. Uh, so yeah, go back to the hotel. I have to stop talking because your girl's out of breath. Jessica, I'm sorry. I need a moment to myself with this beat, though. Hair and outfit in progress. Hey, guys. Wanted to do a quick OOTN because I'm about to step out. We plan to step out at 10 p.m. And, of course, well, actually, it's 11.30, so it's not terrible, but, um... Check for this dress though. I thought it was gonna rain tonight, Sunday, but so that's why I got like a, a long sleeve dress, but it's not raining. My hair is half up, half down. And um, this dress though. I got this from downtown LA. So, sorry. Um, boots, 
I also got these from DSW. Am I tacky for doing this in the bathroom? DSW, um, a couple years ago, and it was like a great investment on my part. But this is my makeup. Check for me. Just landed in LA. <clears throat> My flight was actually supposed to be later. Um, I was supposed to get here like at 11 something, but I was at the airport and I was checkout was at 12. My flight wasn't until 8:40, and I was about to go insane. So I was like, I don't care. I don't. I don't care what the cost is. Get me the hell out of here. Um, I was just over it. That's how I get it. Anytime, basically anytime I travel, like the day that it's time to leave, it's like, get me out of here immediately. Um, anyway, so I'm back home and I look crazy right now, but um, yeah. I really appreciate Los Angeles. I couldn't stay in New York for an extended amount of time. I mean, who knows? Maybe it depends on what I was there for, but it's just congested. So many people. It's hot. It's stinky. Um, it's cool for what it is. Um, people there, yeah, they're blunt. So am I, but I just witnessed so many like fights and stuff. Anyway, I have to get into baggage claim. Thank you for watching, and this is me signing off. Bye!